These drivers get ready to come around the final corner right now to take the green flag here at Watkins Glen. We'll have a nine-lap shootout before the first stage break. And get ready, because here we go. Green flag is in the air at Watkins Glen. And she's a right there, putting his door bumper onto the 11. Looks like Beast went a little off course. He did there, but look, here comes Bulldog. Started, yep, inside. He's side by side. He's going to sneak back in. Cheese has got the preferred line as they're too wide behind him. Here they roll it through, and Cheese just gets sideways a little off to the grass. That's going to open the door for Bulldog. Take it away, Mama Bulldog. <laughs> Uh, just waiting to see if he took the post. I think, I think Jesus is going to still have it. That's a drag race yeah. down this short shoot right now. They're two by two. You wait. It's almost like a, you wait for him to make a mistake. Looks like Bulldog yep. took him right there. Yep, Bulldog's got the lead at this point on Cheesa, but Beast of Asgard is now beating the bumper off the 95 in positions. That's right. There we go. On the leader, the 20. Now with Beast of Asgard cutting through the grass on the inside, they're two by two coming off the carousel with Dagger watching them behind in front of him battle it out. He's, he's, trying, he's taking it from Bulldog. He hasn't taken it quite yet. He's at his quarter panel. Beast getting a little bit of a bump from the 20, holding them off, saying, no, no, no. I didn't mean it. I hear it through the radio. I didn't mean it. I didn't mean it. There goes Beast to the outside. It's three wide as we go to the final corner. Two wide. Move uh, Bulldog. He's going to make it three wide. And Beast gets into the 10 as they should come down the front straight away. Move Beast of Asgard to first. <laughs> yes. See numbers as the 10 looks at the inside of the 20. Coming down the front stretch. It's a drag race into turn one. Door to door. And it looks like Dagger's going to get the... Get the momentum he needs to clear him in the one, but Bulldog is there. Dagger's going to go wide to the outside wall. Bulldog is going to take second from him. Dagger's having a heartbreak of a day here. Two by two. Dagger's going to try to give a little bump. Can't clear it. Oh, he hit the outside wall again. Oh! That allowed Smoke to move into second. That's, that's, that's caution. yeah. Big caution out right there. Now the question is, do these... I think Coco Warranty uh, for sponsoring us. You can reach them at 877-204-0156. Wow, she knows the phone number. I didn't even know there was a phone number for Toco Warranty. She's way on it. There he is. Look at that. You're way better than our brothers in arms and brothers in motorsports. As we're going to ride on board with the 14 as we get ready to go green here at Watkins Glen. Green flag is in the air. And it looks like the 11 is going to get a little bit of run. Smoke's going to try to stay with them. Because Bulldog got up on him. Oh, gosh. Smoke to the lead with Bulldog second. Yep. And the big gap between Smoke or Smoke and Bulldog and with third place, it looks like a Brewster back there. He is holding up this hard-charging field. But this is what the 20 and the 14 want to see. Green daylight behind them as they come through the bus stop. Oh, smoking sideways, a little drifty. Bulldog's going to take it from him. Stage. Oh. So that's why they're racing so hard. And Beast of Asgard's going to make the move to the inside on the 14. They're side by side, but Asgard's got the momentum that he needs. But can he clear the 14 as they come down the front stretch? And he does. Move Smoke Fan to third. Beast of Asgard to second. His targets are now set on that Toyota Camry, the 20 of Bulldog, as he drives into turn one with Smoke right on his rear bumper. Uh, I'm, I have to say, as a mama, I'm proud of him. He's doing a good job. Smokey is catching him, though. Uh, well, Beast of Asgard's catching him now. Yep. And right now, we're looking off the rear bumper of Beast of Asgard as Smoke slings it way out wide to the bus stop. He is having a hard time with that corner. That car may be too loose for him. Let's see if we can't look off the front end. End car. Bulldog off the track. Bulldog right there. You jinxed him. You got him nervous. You got that mama love going on. He didn't know what to do as the 20 car is going to be passed by Beast of Asgard. And the 11 move him to our leader. Let's see if we can't look back off of the 11 and the 20 as they race down the front stretch and move Beast of Asgard firmly into that first place position as he's got about two car length lead on the 20 car.
Let's see if I can't get my nice pretty camera on that 20 real quick and we'll watch him chase down and run down. There we go. They've definitely pulled away, and, and this is what we're watching right now. We're on the left rear quarter panel of the 20s. We come through the bus stop, hard on the brakes, down in the third, let it roll through. He's trying to close that gap on the 11 car. Now we're back in car of the 20 as he's trying to run down this, uh, the 11 as hard as he can. But, man, Beast of Asgard's got a piece of a machinery tonight. As he comes off that carousel, he just drives away. As we're starting to see the gap widen between the 11 and the 20. How many laps left in this stage, Mama Bulldog? This is one more. White flag is out this time. Bye for the end of stage number two. And right now, Beast of... Oh, geez, a wild wide. He's going to drop back quick. But now it's a, it's a race. It's a drag race up the track between the 11 and the 20. They're side to side, door to door, two by two. But, ooh, Bulldog can't quite make the pass as they're coming down the short chute into the bus stop. Move him to third. Bulldog's got, uh, not Bulldog, but uh, Beast of Asgard's got a whole lot of mirror of smoke fan as Jesus sends it through the grass. A little bit of lawn service work here. And Smoke's got a whole lot of mirror full of Bulldog. He's got a whole lot of side panel because the 20 and the 14 are door to door beating and banging. As they come down the short shoot in the final two corners. And this is what Beast of Asgard wants to see. These guys racing. These guys battling. The more they battle and push, the more he can stretch his legs. And Bulldog isn't giving an inch. He's trying. Give a little bumper bump to the 14. Back into the final corner. It was just saying, hi, how's it going? How's your mama? Can I borrow some brown sugar? Because I need second place. How many laps left in this final stage, Mama Bulldog? Green. Coming off this final corner, and they're going to let these horses fly at the Glen with probably about, what would you say, about 20 more laps to go? Uh, yeah, I think that's pretty correct. You want to be on the inside or the outside here? Oh, see, that's the question, because if you can get the momentum on the outside and keep it going, but we're seeing everyone swing wide, so I want to be down low without getting ran over, so I want to take that inside groove. As we're watching right now, I'm not on the leaders because the game's tricked me. There we go. Lead. Bulldog took the lead. Oh, the 41's around in the back back there into his teammate of the four. It is a three-car breakaway between the 20, the 11, and the 48 as they come through the uphill, down the chute, heading into the bus stop. This is where it's really going to matter, though. Can Bulldog hold off the 11 car into the bus stop? Round through. Cleared by two. Here comes the 11. A little bump, a little sideways coming off there through the carousel. Bulldog's going to hold him off. He's got a two-car length gap as we come down. The drivers are getting ready. Green flag is about to drop, I assume, as they're side-by-side, side, two by two. And green flag is in the air at Watkins Glen. We're on board the 14 as we watch this battle in the turn one between 20 and the 11. Bulldog hard on the brakes. He's going to get a bump by the 11. Sorry, Mama Bulldog didn't mean to cut you off there. You're fine. Jump in any time. I can talk all night. <laughs> and they're single filing out in the top three. Let's get off the onboard and watch this action develop in front of us. The hard part is getting back to them. There we go. Into the bus stop. The 11 running down the 20. 20's got about a car length gap. But, oh, he's going to hit the apron again. He's going to slam into the smoke fan. That's going to send him to the outside retaining wall through the carousel. And we watched Beast of Asgard do that a lot. Bulldog swings it out wide. He's going to give up the lead to the 11 car as we come into the final two corners. As he said, he got back in it too early. He got back in it too early, and the car got tight. We talked about it. It's That corner is a high-speed corner, but if the car gets tight and it pushes, you find yourself sliding up and off the track just like the 20 did. As we're looking off the front end now of the 20 car, as he's looking at Beast of Asgard slowly get smaller and smaller in front of his windshield. Oh, Beast of Asgard just hit the inside retaining wall. What just happened there? We're looking back now off the 20. Oh, Beast of Asgard's going to swing it wide through turn one. I'm back on him. Bulldog's going to follow him, but he's going to hit the outside retaining wall. 
is going to send it to the inside on the final corner. He's giving it everything he's got. Everything he has. He wants He wants to get in front of these two. It's a championship race at this point. Now he's just calling for points. Dive bombs it in the one. Can't get it to stick. He's got to get out of the throttle. That's going to let Smoke get back in front of him, try to stretch his legs on the uphill. And you got to be real smooth here. Any mistake could send it to that right side wall. We've seen it happen. That's, that's allowing Cheezer to pull away a little bit. Huh? That's what, yes, ma'am, and that's what Cheezer wants to see is these two guys racing and battling it out. Because if they fight, that means they're not running him down. They're just battling each other. And Bulldog giving a little bit of room. Oh, go ahead. Oh, he got. Here he comes back on the inside. It's a it's a drag race right now. Yeah, it's a Ford Camry drag race. Beast of Asgard. He's done it. He's held off everyone. Go ahead. Oh, Bulldog just passed Cheesa. Oh, two to go. Sorry, two to go this time. There's my math coming into play. Hey, it's all right. Like I said, I'm not very good at math either. But we got two laps to go, and Beast of Asgard is just being a beast. We're going to keep our eyes on him right now as he's coming through. He's got a lap and a half left to go to walk away I here a winner. I'd like to see a caution come out. Oh, I don't think you're going to see one come out this late. I don't either. We, you, we, I like to pray to the ghost of Dale Earnhardt Sr. when I need things good to happen. So if you try, it's like Santa Claus. It might happen. But right now with with, with Bulldog only – not Bulldog, but uh, Beast of Asgard only having about – I would say 12 more turns to go. This is all said and done. Now he's coming down the front stretch. White flag in the air. Flagman pointing to him. One to go. One to go for Beast of Asgard. As he dives it in the turn one for one final time. Right off the corner. Swings it wide. Heads up the uphill. Doing everything he can to hold on to this race lead. He doesn't want to wreck it now. Because he wants to walk away a winner. At Watkins Glen. See if we can't go on board with him here for a little bit. Listen to the motor as he dives into the bus stop here. Into the carousel. Still on board with our leader, the 11 car. He's only got two more corners to go. We got a battle for third and fourth. We'll see if we can't get to... Third is going to Bulldog right now as we're here and... But right now, we're looking here at, at Mr. FedEx himself, Beast of Asgard in the 11. One more corner to go before he can call himself a winner and outlaw. The checkered flag is in the air. The confetti is flying because Beast of Asgard is going to be your winner in that number 11 FedEx Toyota Camry here at Watkins Glen. Great job. I, I picked him. And let's see. Here's the calamity through the fire. Oh, my goodness gracious. The 95 just sit. Oh, wait, is the 95 a lap down? What's going on here? Bulldog ran out of gas. Bulldog is out of gas. Bulldog out of gas. That's going to take the 14. That